Meg and Sam have asked me to recite a little ditty. And they thought, I promise you, it may not be very pretty. But I've got the tissues ready. And just in case I blow, as I instruct them both about the marriage club. I thought that the best thing was to give them a clue of the secrets of married life and the best thing to do. And so, as the baker in the family, I thought it best to give them both a recipe. A recipe for success. The recipe for a good marriage is a little pinch of understanding and a tablespoon of trust, a drop of fun and flattery and a smattering of lust, a teaspoon of adventure, a heap of hopes and wishes, an ounce or two of thoughtfulness and a scoop of hugs and kisses, a grain or two of patience, a dash of admiration, a slice of friends and family, and a cup of conversation. A dollop of devotion, a soup son of surprise, a bunch of boring household chores, <laughs> and a spot of compromise, a drizzling of honesty, and a sprinkling of laughter and with a splash of patience and support, it all makes happy ever after. Deep on a mountain beach, my heart is away, but my brain is asleep, and I don't There are three words stronger than I love you, and today I say, I choose you. I choose you over all of us, including David Tennant. <laughs> I choose you to build the rest of our lives with, with Elton by our side. We can continue to grow our family, making traditions, memories and magic along the way. Do you remember the very first day that we met? I know it only feels like yesterday, but I know you would be the one to make me as happy as I am today. I'm lucky to stand here and call you my husband, my smelly, my Samuel. <laughs> when you're not here, I'm missing a part of me because my hand fits in yours like a missing puzzle piece. And I promise you will never lose me and we will always be complete. I promise to try not to leave my contact lenses laying around. <laughs> Even if I cannot up. see them. However, without them, I can't see the pots you've left in the sink. <laughs> so who's the real winner? <laughs> I promise to be your teammate forever. When the road looks rough ahead and you're miles and miles from your nice warm bed, just remember what your wife said. Do as you're flipping told. <laughs> <laughs> I promise to be your soulmate. Best friend and wife, I promise to honour, love and cherish you through all life's adventure. Wherever we'll go, we'll go together, always and forever. Megs, I promise to travel the world to be by your side, climbing mountains with the rain or shine. I promise to help us achieve every dream, every moment of our lives together. I promise to hold you tight in the rain and let you run free in the sunshine. I promise to be in your corner to pick you for every game or every challenge. <laughs> I promise to love and adore all your quirks. <laughs> I promise to always share my time, my happiness, my strengths and my weaknesses with you. It's brilliant how many of us could be here today. Myself and Meg are really overwhelmed with the turnout. But I'd also like to think about people that also couldn't be here and I'm sure we've all had a brief moment throughout the day. I'd like to thank my amazing wife. Uh, you're my proudest adventure, so thank you for that. And thank you for letting me make this, make this today happen and letting me make that title happen of being my wife. Thank you for being the best friend, the best doggy mum for our perfect little family. I always love you almost as much as I do. 
So grab your drinks and raise your glass to the newest Mrs. V. 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 Mr